Hi, it's Caleb with App Design Tips, and today I'm going to show you how to convert your Photoshop designs into Sketch to continue designing in Sketch from Photoshop. So here you can see a design for a music player, and this was done in Photoshop. So if we save this file, first of all, we can browse online to avocode.com slash convert PSD to Sketch. And this link is in the video description. And here we can just choose our Photoshop file and convert this directly into Sketch. So let's try this here. If I scroll down, I can choose this artboard. I'm going to click Open. And now you can type your email address where you want this to be sent to. And click Convert to Sketch. And while this is converting, it does its best to try to convert every element native to how you would design it in Sketch, but it's not 100% perfect. So I want to show you what this looks like in Sketch and how we can clean it up for anything that might be missing. So I received the email here, and I can click Download Sketch File. And when I do that, you can see it's now a Sketch document. So let's just open this up here and see what it looks like. Okay, I'm going to zoom out here. I'm going to just grab this Photoshop document and just take a screenshot of this here. Take that screenshot and I'll paste this inside here just to see how close it matched. So you can see this does pretty good, but it didn't match some of these colors and I assume it's because there were some color overlay features in Photoshop it didn't know how to convert. So it's easy to go in here and first of all we can change some of these colors. I'm just going to match this color here. And same thing with this white music. I'm going to just make this white here. And now I have a change text. I can just change this to blue. And really looking at this now, within a few seconds, I've matched the look of Photoshop and I have the editability of Sketch. And now here, we can see that everything looks pretty sharp, pretty clean, and because these were SVG icons or shapes inside Photoshop, they actually saved as shapes here in Sketch, so it did a really good job. And I notice if I zoom in here, that in Photoshop this was created as two shapes, but I can still click on both of these here and click this union button and create one shape. So you can see here just in a few short minutes I can recreate something from Photoshop, I can put it into Sketch and just clean up a few things, and then I can continue where I left off inside Sketch. And I can even group some of these elements, create new symbols, and start reusing these elements across my design. I hope you enjoyed this tip, and if you did, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that bell icon to be notified of future tips and tutorials.